this point with, with where we're at offensively. Uh, I think one of the most important things is the guys being out there being productive. Um, to me to say this guy has to be the guy that's going, I don't really feel that way. Uh, I want it to be uh, the guy out there on the field. I want him to be continuously productive, and that's really the most important thing to me. Are there different defenses or different looks that, that Dwayne or Miles is, are more successful against? Um, I wouldn't necessarily say there's different defenses or defensive looks. I think there's, uh, you know, their style is so different. Um, you know, Dwayne being more of kind of a long strider guy uh, and Miles being more of your kind of scat back who can, you know, make has great feet, great vision, and can make guys miss in, in a small space. I think that's really the big thing. I think uh, when it came to the past couple weeks, you know, we played Cal the week before. It was just some big gaping holes where Dwayne was able to kind of open up a little bit. And really this past week, you know, Miles was able to make some things happen uh, just by being patient and using his vision. Did you think going into that game that – that Miles would have as many carries as he did, or was it just kind of the way the game played out? Yeah, believe it or not, I'm not psychic, so I just kind of go how the yeah. game plays, <laughs> how the game plays out. But I'm um, glad it worked out the way it did, and you know, Miles was able to get some good experience out there. It's just, you know, it's really been fun kind of watching him develop uh, week after week. And you know, as, as, as I always say, as a group, we just got to continually uh, to be more, continue to be more consistent and get better is each that, week. Is that kind of patience rare for someone his age? Uh, no, I don't think it's necessarily rare for someone his age. I think we've seen it, uh, you know, when we, were, when we were recruiting him. But I think uh, the level, his level of maturity and how he's handled being able to play as a true freshman, uh, the game hasn't been too big for him. I think the first game was the only game where you can kind of sense he was a little, had a little bit of anxiety. But outside of that, I think that's what the most impressive thing is uh, how mature he is and how well, how much he can handle when the game is going on. As far as the carries go, 